all right everyone welcome to the video today we are answering your questions again but this time we have it we have a a new person we have someone else who's joining us uh his name is being carried a lot of y'all may know him from from twitch because i know a lot of y'all watch him and watch me at the same time uh he he does exist um yeah so he's gonna be answering a few of your questions i will also be answering them as well so we're gonna get two different answers on some of them Hope you guys do enjoy this make sure to leave a like and subscribe as well as going to go and follow carried on on his streams as well i'll leave his link in the description so make sure to go look at those so the first question they ask how to make friends uh there's a lot of ways of doing it you know it's, you can hear one of the ways i'm doing right now actually just a good old clash of clans you know oh uh, clash of clans is a good one that was that yeah, was my yeah. that was my that was my middle school high school game Got, gotta be got, gotta be go to right there um i would i would say that uh you know in in school being in a club like sports like for me basketball was a good way i made a lot of friends uh also maybe if you if you get a job <laughs> you do make some friends there as well uh because you know there's people there actually, you can socialize a little being bit being reasonable in society you gotta be kidding me <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be kidding me no just slap someone silly until they become your friend true i'll agree with that one i'll agree with that one i support that not really <laughs> okay we um definitely condone <laughs> <laughs> okay uh what do you plan to accomplish in life just trying to make people happy fight others depression you know there's too much hate in the world that's what i think yes so trying to bring some positivity especially with coronavirus being a thing that is, that is a very solid answer. Um, I, I've mentioned that to two before on streams. Like, that's why I stream is just to make people, you know, kind of get away from reality for a little bit because reality is a lot of times negative. Uh, it's pretty much just trying to make people happy and make everything positive so that we can, we can escape from the negatives of everyday life. What's your least favorite shotgun in Arsenal? It's probably going to be the pump, Ooh. I think, because the pump just... It can one shot, but the distance of it is just too close for my preference. Yes, I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, like, use this answer it's... for mine as well. Um, I'm gonna say the Nutcracker because oh, I can understand that. Yeah, because one, why is it even in the game? <laughs> it shouldn't be in the game. It's it's a it's a hol it's a holiday event thing. Like, why is it still there? I don't understand. <laughs> Don't ask me, buddy. Don't ask me. Why do they still have the present in the game? Why do they have a trash can in the Snowball, game? Snowball, bro. <laughs> There's so, so many things in there that just don't make sense. The pumpkin. I can fully understand the Nutcracker because the Nutcracker is the stupidest, worst hit res shotgun there is. It's, it is oh so my. bad on fire rate as well. And it's only four shots, which makes it worse. Calico is 100% the best shotgun. Spaz coming in a close second or maybe third Ooh. place because it's automatic. Pump shotgun, it's just there. It's just there. It's got no specialty behind it. We got two automatic shotguns. We got a double jump shotgun. We got a one shot shotgun. We got a long range shotgun, the inertial one. It's just, it's just out there. The pump shotgun. It's a normal shotgun, but it has no specialty out. See, but you didn't you didn't mention the AA12 though. AA12 is AA12. We don't talk about it because then people start topping on Phantom Forces and then everyone gets mad. <laughs> That's true. That is true. Okay. That's part of why I don't play a Phantom Force is because baby rage. Yes, yeah, sir. <laughs> okay. Uh, do you it's still remember rage. the first and few people in your streams? Yeah, of course. I remember all of them. In fact, I can go find them real quick. Ooh. One of them. Uh, one of them is my mod, even so. Nice. The two of them. See, when I started was was last year, so uh, <laughs> it's Same. uh. I've lost a few of them. Uh, one of them, the yeah, first one I was, was when I played Stardew Valley. That was my first game I streamed. Um, and uh, his name was Bionic Worm. However, in the past month, he uh, completely left everything. So I don't know what happened to him. Mm. Um, but yeah, I still have quite a few of them still here. Uh, one of them is in band. The other three that are that are still here from, from the beginning days uh, are still are still active in the community. So it's, it's great to see Let's them. Go. Shout out to, to QB. Um, uh okay hold on this is awkward um hold on just, just thinking a little bit uh maddie maddie of course and floody yeah shout out to you guys and matt forgot about matt he's my youtube mod 
right. with me my charity event you're in it yeah yes. um that's somewhat for my one year anniversary on twitch because i've been on roblox streaming for since mixer 2018 type of thing but Ooh. twitch since mixer went down this is my one year anniversary type of thing because my one year anniversary is on the 11th and that's a monday so oh i was like heck it i'm just gonna do a week long uh charity event and i was gonna yeah. celebrate the 11th on a different day yeah you know and i've had three separate breaks during my whole entire time which is a lot of breaks in my opinion and that's definitely crashed my stuff multiple times the first one i had was because of um my computer kept on crashing but i upgraded my gpu and everything got fixed then i uh had to go visit my grandpa because he was having medical issues so i had that which was a big break and crashed again and then I had a recent one, which I don't remember, but it was like a two week break. And it wasn't that bad in that one. Yeah. I've just been but having to deal with school ones. and stuff. So, like, I'm very inconsistent at the moment because of school and work. So, yeah, that's true. Trying my best. But, yeah. Uh, let's see here. Uh, what's one place you want to visit on Earth? Dutch Islands, UK, Ireland. What else? Uh, Mars. I don't know. <laughs> Mars, yes. Visit on Earth and we say Mars. That is a wonderful answer. I don't just say Norway because uh I think on my dad's side we have some uh some relatives up there and they have like this really cool house on on a like one of the hill mountain things and uh yeah. it looked pretty cool and there's a lot of good uh ter ter terraforming. Yes. <laughs> yeah, the word is. That's geography. Yes, geography. That's that's Thing I was terraforming for. the stuff we do to annihilate the planet and <laughs> build a hole all the way down to china yes let's go i'm willing to put my entire savings account into that fund bro just ask mario to do it he's got a uh some sort of hat he can use from odyssey right what was that it was the drill hat right i think so yeah i, I don't remember i don't remember it's been a while i gotta finish up my odyssey game yeah. but i lost my way the next question what is your favorite dog um golden retriever golden retriever that's, of course yeah so my, my dog um is, is a poodle which eh, he's he's interesting it's a very Dude, interesting thing right now i have an apertranian mixed pit bull and he's the chonkiest boy he's literally a sausage link bro, that's, he's <laughs> literally just a sausage you totally my pug bro <laughs> oh my goodness my pug is a legit chungus bro and then the final question we have uh, for this is what was your favorite game to ever play whether it was growing up or currently oh favorite game to ever play terraria 100 percent. i've never been the um, biggest fan of it um i mean i've i used to watch it as a kid but i've never really played it but now it's just like i don't hey, know well i'll just say this okay the first world i ever made on terraria was the first well no it was my second first ever character because the first one got corrupted but the second character i ever made with the first world i played that non-stop for like three years dude and on that single world alone i got two thousand hours in terraria just that <laughs> world alone i was no oh life goodness. grinding the whole thing and then i kept on playing vanilla with some friends all the way up to three thousand hours not even modded not even modded that's just how much i enjoyed the game and then finally, when I reached 3,000 hours, I started playing modded. And I'm still at 3,500 hours now. I'm still playing it more and more. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> it's just a good game, dude. That absolute yeah. best game ever. Yeah, I'd like to know how much hours I have on Minecraft. Because I used to play that a whole lot. But uh, you know. Terraria is better than Minecraft, yeah. even though it's meant to be slightly a copy. I would say that my favorite games as a kid that I had the most enjoyment playing was Roller Coaster Tycoon 3. And Madagascar Yo. Mini Golf on the Wii. Those Dude, were Roller Coaster Tycoon Three was a bomb, actually. It was, bro. I, I that's probably the game I have the most hours in total. Cause like I would just play that for like six or seven hours a day, even uh, during the summer or like after school. I just played that game all the time oh my gosh dude negative 800 g's dude literal negative 800 g's i love that literally He's turning spending... people into micro dust what are you spending what are you, what are you doing on people man 
<laughs> listen, listen, okay? I'm one of those people that goes into sandbox, doesn't care, doesn't even make an entrance to the park. They're just stuck there forever once they enter. And then they're forced to ride this one roller coaster and just fly off into space. That's awful. <laughs> no, what do you mean? It's fireworks. Oh, yeah. Totally. It's just fireworks, but we only have red fireworks. Oh, oh God. <laughs> oh, God. This is some squid game type thing, bruh. Bur oh, my Lord. I always play that, like, realistically. I could never, like, my brother is always the one that made, like, the intense roller coasters that just killed everyone. But I was just, like, realistic with everything. Wow, you're actually nice to society. Wow. I am. Imagine wow. that. Wow. <laughs> Imagine being nice wow. in 2021, bruh. All right, that is all for today. Thank you, Carrie, for being here and answering these questions from from these people that are so desperate for for knowing uh, the, these answers because they're 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 the world's answers that or the world's questions that need answered. That's that's what I meant to say. Yeah. Um, but I also do want to mention, uh, Carrie has an event October third to the 9th, Besides the Tuesday and Wednesday of that week, uh, it is called Carrie's Rush for Charity. Um, again, it's October third to the 9th. Uh, besides Tuesday and Wednesday, um, I will be participating in the events as well. So make sure to go over to Carried Stream, uh, follow his Twitch, and be there for the event. And uh, watch watch me um, probably lose in most of the events because I'm bad at everything. We all know that. Well, I got a question for you, real quick. Yes. Who's Joe? Do I do I do I have to answer this? Am I required to, to ask who Joe is? Oh, he left. Oh, great. He, he left me. That's wonderful. I'm sitting in, in, a, in a VC on my own. He's now spamming me with monkeys. This is a wonderful experience. I'm, I'm so glad I did this. Okay. That was unexpected. 